I believe in the New Testament power of the Spirit of God. I believe in the fullness of the Spirit. I believe Jesus is the only way to heaven. I believe He's the Son of God. I believe in the Holy Ghost and power. I believe in the baptism of the Holy Spirit. I believe it's for me, my children, and my grandchildren. I believe that speaking in tongues is real. You speak in English, that's a tongue, and you don't argue over that. I served the devil. He didn't let me speak in tongues at all, so it can't be of the devil. I believe in the Holy Spirit that gives the word of knowledge. I believe in the gift of healing. If healing's in the old covenant, it's got to be in the new covenant. I believe not only in the historical Jesus, but don't you forget about the miracle working Jesus. I believe Jesus Christ was the greatest teacher ever to walk the earth. I believe he was the greatest preacher to ever walk the earth. I believe he was a prophet. I believe he was a priest. I believe he was a king. But we forget about the miracle working Jesus, who in his lifetime, if we were recorded all the miracles he did perform, John said all the books on the planet would not be able to contain all the miracles of Jesus. And if we're not careful as a universal yet local body of New Testament believers, we will lay aside the supernatural part of Jesus Christ. We'll believe in the teacher. We'll believe in the generational blood. We'll believe in all the facts about Jesus. But Jesus Christ, the same yesterday, today, and forever. And I still believe in the power of a living, ever-loving, never-dying-anymore Savior that still performs miracles. I believe if you welcome the Holy Spirit, He will come. And if He shows up, miracles will happen. I'm sorry. I apologize. I still believe in the fire that the Word of God brings. And we're not going to back up nor deny it. I don't care how big we get. I still believe that there is a place called heaven. And that it's real. It's real, y'all. I believe in miracles.